it's right there in the first five verses of his gospel. In the beginning was the Word. The Word is face to face with God and the Word is God. All things came into being through him. That's Jesus. That's the Father, Son, that's the Word. Not one thing came into being apart from him. Therefore, he is the source and the meaning of human existence. He is the light of our lives. Verse five, and the light shines in the darkness and the darkness doesn't understand. It can't conquer it, but it doesn't understand it. That sets up the problem for John. It's not uh, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth and God is holy and Adam and Eve botched it and someone has got to pay for this to straighten out this mess. For John, it is we're included in this beautiful life of relationship between the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit and we don't know it. And not only did we not know it, we're miserable and broken and sad and overwhelmed internally with fear and, and uh, projecting into the future and self-centeredness and narcissism. So he says, and the light shines in the darkness and the darkness doesn't understand. And so, what then is the Son being good to do? And so the Word becomes flesh.